global maritime industry is making a sea change with technology, automation, efficiency and business positioning key to the future, very relevant to trade on the Belt and Road. That's also true for port operators like Hong Kong-based Hutchison Ports, as the group's Eric Ip recalls from his early days in the industry. I saw about over 20 uh, we call multi-tray shipping lines or global shipping lines and today it's less than 10. So we've got to do smarter and better so sustain our position in, in this uh, competition landscape. Part of that regrading is the launch of a new internet app for use across the group for monitoring the status of containers. And Hutchison Ports continues to develop and share its award-winning NGen IT operation system wholly developed in Hong Kong. I think we have built a very uh, powerful and user-friendly and high technology system uh, to facilitate most of our port operations overseas. Hong Kong have wealth experience in that and we can also draw on the resource from China as well. Hong Kong is a place where people have ambition and they will drive. People are a place which can make things happen. We talk about more and more automation. Full automation is then you have to build a new system to cope with uh, full automation. Efficiency and sustainability or reliability is our key. We've got to be seen as very consistent in providing our service. Call it the birth on arrival. So we got to give them the right punctuality so that the ship can go to the next port on time. So we have a very tight port time to handle a vessel. The system itself will give us an assurance that we can complete all the load and discharge of containers of a vessel within the given port time. So this is critical. As Hutchison Ports repositions for the future, Hong Kong's role is elevated, while China's Belt and Road Initiative reinforces business priorities. The port portfolio of Hutchison Port have 22 locations which are along one belt, one road. I think it just come in the right time, you know. It just reinforces a trend which has started. I think Hong Kong is the right place to run this global port network because Hong Kong has been named as a super connector. Uh, we don't just connect the business, we connect the people, the culture, the system, and uh, everything that's required to fulfill our expansion dream. Mm -hmm.